टूडे माई टॉपिक इज ऑन हाइस्ट कॉमन फैक्टर ऑफ एच एफ इट इज अ मैथमेटिक्स प्रोजेक्ट सो लेट स्टार्ट माई क्वेश्चन इज सिक्स एंड टेन सो हेयर सिक्स एंड एंड हेयर सेवन टेन कॉइन्स सो आई विल रिमूव सिक्स कॉइन्स So here are six coins. Here are four coins. So I will remove four coins. There are two coins and there are four coins. So I will remove two coins. Now no more coins to remove from six and ten. So the answer will be two. Hello. My name is Prabha Shah and I am from class 5 of North Point Senior Secondary Boarding School. Today my topic is basic fractions. Fraction is a part of a whole. Here we have a whole square and we have divided it into two equal parts. We can write it as 1 by 2 that's the half and if we take the whole that's 2 by 2 that is equal to the same whole now here we have an and a square and we have divided it into three equal parts we can take 1 out of 3 that's 1 by 3 we can take 2 out of 3 that's 2 by 3 and we can take all of them as 3 by 3 that is equal to the same whole here we have taken a circle and we have divided it into three equal parts we can take one of it as 1/3 we can take 2 out of it as 2 by 3 we can take the whole as 3 by 3 now here we have a triangle we can, we have here four equal parts and we can take one out of it that's 1 by 4 we can take Two out of it, that's two by four. We can take three out of it, that's three by four, and all of them together as four by four. This is our end of our lesson. Thank you. Good morning, my respected teachers and my dear friends. I am Abhijit Banerjee of Class Five. I am here with a math project. From the childhood, we know we should know the tables. So today, for a game, I have an example of the table of twelve. So how can we learn any table through a game? It's very interesting and very we can do it with very fun. So let's see. Here is twelve ones are twelve. Two ones are twenty-four. Mm-hmm. And now, if our teacher asks that after twelve three are thirty six, what is twelve eight are? So we will turn, 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 and here is our eight. So you can see twelve eight are is ninety six. So like this, we can go on and on, and the last one is twelve three are one twenty. So like this, we can. Run table through game is very fun and very interesting. Thank you. My name is Swastika of Class Five. I am doing a math project called Factorization Tree. So this is my math project. This is the number one two nine six. This number is divided by twenty four and fifty four. Twenty four is divided by four and six, and fifty four is divided by six and nine. And four is divided by two and two. Six is divided by two and three. 
6 is another 6 is divided by 2 and 3 and 9 is divided by 3 and 3. So this is my fertilization project. Thank you. Good evening everyone. My name is Aditya Chatterjee from class 5. My topic is on place value chart. Now I make this project on place value. So we will take an example on a number to show in this place value chart. Now for example we will take 10,000. So 10,000's place will be on 1, 1,000's place will be on 0, 100's place will be on 0, 10's place also be 0, 1's place will also be 0. So this is 10,000. Now we will take another example to show in this place value chart. Let's take 63,424. So we will place 10,000. On 6, thousands will be on 3, hundreds place will be on 4, one, a tens place will be on 2, ones place will be on 4. So this is 63,424. This is my project. Thank you. Hello everyone. I am Prakriti Samudrai from class 5. I am going to explain my maths project. The topic of my maths project is fraction numbers. Now let's start it. My first example that I will take is 2 by 4. What is numerator and what is denominator? Now let's note. The lower number is called denominator and the upper number is called the numerator. Now I will take the example 3 by 4. Now I have done it 3 by 4. There are 4 total parts and 3 are colored. We all can see that. Now I will take the example that is 4 by 4. Now the all parts are colored. It is also known as whole number. Now I will take the another example which is 2 by 8. Now here it is 8 parts. The total, num the total number is 8 parts. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. In the 8 parts, 2 parts are colored. So the answer will be 2 by 8. Now, 4 by 8. Now, it is 4 by 8. Now, we all can see that, it, that in 8 parts, 4 parts are colored. So, the answer will be 4 by 8. And now, I will take the example 6 by 8. I have done it. Here, 8 parts are there. The total number is 8 and the color number is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Now, the answer will be 6 by 8. Now, I will take the example 
8 by 8. Now, I have taken the example 8 by 8. In 8 by 8, by eight full parts are colored. Means no parts are they are uncolored. So, the answer will be 8 by 8. Thank you for watching my project video. Good evening everyone. Myself, Tiasha Mitro of class 5. Today, my topic is on decimal numbers. Now, let's know about the definition of decimal numbers. A decimal number can be defined as a number whose whole number part and the fractional part is separated by a decimal point. The dot in decimal number is called a decimal point. Now, let's know about an example of decimal numbers. Now, I have made a decimal numbers chart. This is the whole number place and this is the fractional place. And this is a decimal point. Now, I will be put here um, 7, 3, 1, 4, 3.5, 7, 4. It is called as 73,143.574. Now, let's know about a, another example of decimal, simple example of decimal numbers. Now, we all know that 1 by 10 is a fractional number. But if we want to represent it as a decimal number, so it will be represent as 0 0.1. Thank you. Good morning to my teacher and my friends. My name is Aishidas from class 5. Today I am going to present project on the parts of bar graph. So, what is bar graph? A, gra a chart that you use the bars to show compares between categories of data. Title. A title of what the graphic is about. Label. A label of what is being counted. Scale. A scale showing the interval and amount of data. Categories. The categories of the data. Label. A label of what the categories are about. Bars. The bars that shows how much have been counted. They are divided into two bar graphs. One is horizontal, second one is vertical. So this is the basic knowledge. So this is the basic knowledge of bar graph. Thank you. Good evening to my respected ma'am and my dear friends. I, I myself, Sandipan Bera, to standing in front of you to discuss an interesting fact about multiplication. Now please have a look on this project. For example, if we want to count table number 2, then we have to say 2 1 ja 2, 2 2 ja 4, 2 3 ja 6, 2 4 ja 8, 2 5 ja 10. I want to conclude my project by saying that nothing is impossible if we practice our maths by enjoying it. Thank you. Good evening, Miss. My name is Aditya Bhaman. Today I am presenting my math project, expanded form and expanded form and place value. For example, four eight three one. 
in one place this is three in ten place this is ten in hundred place this is eight hundred in thousand place this is four thousand another example six seven three one in one place this is one in ten place this is thirty in and hundred place this is seven hundred in thousand place this is six thousand thank you